We're at Oak Creek Canyon. We're gonna, on our way to Allen's Bend. It looks like a pending. There's a storm pending, but we're gonna we're gonna risk it because we're we're pioneers. So yeah, the next thing you see is probably gonna be us in that water. This is the Oak Creek Canyon Trail. It's kind of rocky. Not that bad of a drop off. I think this is the right way. Well, we'll find out soon enough. Um, suit yourself, Natalie. Whoop. You're fine. Okay, we'll we'll meet you at the creek. We'll meet you at the creek. I'm just walking up more part of the Oak Creek Canyon Trail. We're trying to get down to the river, but they've got like a sheer sheer cliff up there. Pretty pretty sweet. I mean, the vegetation is less cactusy right now because we're so close to the water, but yeah. So what we got for you? Well, we found the tarantula. I think it's effing massive. Get a picture of it. Oh my god. How do we get it to move so it doesn't chase me? With a stick? Yeah, it's 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 the real deal. Um, how do we get around it? <laughs> this is as close as we get to the creek because we uh, ran into that tarantula, and there was um, poisonous snakes in the grass and poison ivy and poison oak. So this is as far as we got right now. But we might try a different trail at some point. We made it to the creek. Please don't slip. People can swim down here. We didn't bring our bathing suits. If I knew we could do this, I would have brought my bathing suit for sure. This looks fine. It's starting to rain, so I'm gonna put this away. We are at a, a scenic look over, look, look, look out on the way to Flagstaff. And I noticed the vegetation, it's all pine trees now. No cacti anywhere in oh wow. This is this is great. Beautiful, beautiful scenery. As far as the eye can see. Lizard. Where? Uh, he's going in a little hole. Lizard in a hole. Here's just another view. I think we're, what are we, 6,000 feet up right now? 6,480. 6,480 feet up. We have another 500 to go before we get to Flagstaff. And then another 1,000 before we get to the Grand Canyon. Here's another really nice view. We just went up that road. It was a windy, windy road. You gotta be running up behind me. Oh my god! What is it? Butterfly. Butterflies are beautiful. Oh I used to call. I used to call you. Me. What does it say? If you think I'm cute, you should see my aunt. Nice. There's a good view. Whoa. Oh, look, there's a cactus. <laughs> I rescind my previous statement. <laughs> Some sort of bird flying. This is, this is beautiful. Beautiful. On the way to Flagstaff is where this is. Um, what is this place called? Cave, Cave Creek Canyon? I think that's what it's called. Turkey vulture. Try to get a picture of it. Two of them. There's a switchback, so we had to come up to get here. It's 15 miles an hour the whole way up. Because, I mean, talking like pin, pin curves, like, I don't know if you see that RV down there. But it's like, yeah. Nutty, man. They're literally everywhere. My wife is in love with these, but they carry the plague, so you don't want to be, uh, you don't want to handle them in bad ways. Wake up today to snow-capped mountains in Arizona. 
crazy people go crazy. Just here on my morning walk at uh, the Little America Hotel we're checking out today. We're gonna be going to a ghost town today in Jerome. So you know, there's nature, uh, nature trails you can walk on here. There's a pool, I and mean, there's wildlife everywhere. And you got rabbits, squirrels, prairie dogs. Um, we saw a lot of elk yesterday, but it's, it's just real nice, real nice hotel in Flagstaff. I suggest if you come here that you stay. And the room rates aren't really that bad. Yeah, I don't know what that was. Some sort of woodpecker, blue, blue woodpecker. Um, but it. Uh, Room rates average about 120 to 130 a night, depending on what night you come. The rooms are real nice, as you saw from last year's video. But, yeah, that's about it. I'm gonna just keep on walking back to the room. It's about a mile walk to the gas station from where we are at. Maybe a little less, but it gets the blood flowing. About 6 a.m. local time. I'm still not on my still haven't changed over time yet so I'm getting up real early which isn't bad because when I go home I'm not gonna have to worry about fighting with jet lag too bad but, you know you can get married over here heated pool you know it's just a real nice area peace out not crossfit your